everyone! Welcome back to Ninja Iraqi Dinar News. I'm Farwa, and we've got some exciting developments for you today. Prime Minister Mohammed Shia al Sudani has just directed the formation of a joint Iraqi Turkish Economic Committee. This move comes amidst positive developments in the US dollar exchange market, all aimed at ensuring economic stability. Let's delve into the details. A knowledgeable governmental source revealed on Sunday that Prime Minister al Sudani's directive is not just a mere formality. It involves the establishment of a comprehensive committee that brings together various governmental entities and private sector representatives from both Iraq and Turkey. This committee is set to play a crucial role in enhancing economic ties between the two nations. The directive specifically outlines the formation of an Iraqi-Turkish joint committee, representing market forces, Iraqi and Turkish economic organizations. From the Iraqi side, we have key players like the Iraqi Private Banks League, the Iraqi Turkish Business Council, the Iraqi Chambers of Commerce Federation, and the Iraqi Contractors Union. And on the Turkish side, their counterparts will be involved. What's interesting is that this committee will convene semi-annually, submitting comprehensive reports directly to Prime Minister al-Sudani. The goal? To strengthen the strategic partnership between Iraq and Turkey. The committee is set to engage in direct dialogue on the reciprocal deal, negotiating with the Turkish Exporters Assembly and the Turkish Central Bank. This move aligns with the Turkish desire to use the local currency for transactions. But that's not all. The directive also aims to finance a portion of the four supportive baskets – food, pharmaceuticals, construction, and spare parts. These initiatives are part of the Prime Minister's policy to defend price stability in Iraq. Now, let's talk about the recent changes in the US dollar exchange rates against the Iraqi dinar. In recent weeks, we've witnessed a gradual decline in the US dollar exchange rates against the Iraqi dinar. From nearly 170,000 Iraqi dinars per $100 last month, it has dropped to 150,000 dinars per $100 this week. According to Muthana Mohammed Saleh, the financial and economic advisor to the Prime Minister, Iraq's high reserves of foreign currency and effective management of foreign trade financing are contributing factors to this positive trend. As Saleh highlights, the parallel market is approaching the official central market due to the regularity of private sector foreign trade and the flexibility exhibited by banks. This is an exciting time for Iraq and Turkey as they embark on this joint economic venture. We'll be keeping a close eye on the developments and bringing you the latest updates. That's all for now. Stay tuned for more Ninja Iraqi DNR news. I'm Farwa, signing off.